Hey, I'm on. I'm about, um, I'm actually in the clean out on the interior wall. So it is galvanized uh, pipe. And uh, you can see there's a, there's a line uh, tying in right here above me on the right. Uh, we're heading down the line. This has been jetted. What we found was a broken pipe. Um, the white stuff is actually the grease buildup we were talking about jetting. There's a really big piece right there, uh, probably at about an eighth inch thick. Let me get past that. I need to get to the real. Need to get to the problem here. So coming forward, we're actually going to go underwater here for a sec. So this is the actual Y. You can see the opening. Here is the pipe. Here's the opening for the hole. And it goes directly into, uh, hits another pipe. You can see the bottom of pipe. And we go dark. And the reason for this is you can see there's a ridge right there. And then we got sand. So what we have is a broken pipe. Um, and this is probably the cause of why you're having so many problems in this apartment. Um, I'm trying to give you a good best view I can. Right there, broken pipe, pull back real slow. You can see there's like a little bit of a ridge right there. Coming back out. Try to show you this Y on the kitchen line right here. So coming in again, we have the opening for the Y. Right there. And then we have the broken pipe right here. And it goes into the dirt basically. So we do have a broken pipe and this is actually going toward the bathroom area. Everything is gonna go into the bathroom section. Uh, I'm gonna have to get with you on this one, but this is the apartment unit number 10. We're actually inside the apartment here. Uh, this is unit number 10 right here. Here's the countertop. There's the clean out that we're going through, okay? So I'll give you a call on this one. Drop it up. Come on, there's nothing else we can do. Gotta give him a bid. $2,800 jack out of the floor. <clears throat> Rebuild the tree from the toilet. Uh, if the four inch needs to be messed with, probably not. It's probably just that bottom of the Y where it drives in. And if that's either the 4 inch or the 2 inch on the back of it, drop a new Y in for the 2 inch coming in and replace the Y that it drops into. Cut out that section. There we go. That would be. Huh? Yeah, oh, heck yeah. I mean, definitely, without a doubt. Take some more photos. Thank <laughs> you.